we are not okay and we are actually disgusted by the decision that was made by the management. Number one, they are not even sure who bent whatever that was bent to a point that I know that we were not involved. We don't even know the location of the place that was bent. Number two, they decided to just chase us out when they haven't even communicated with us to see what is going to be the safety measures for the students. The management needs to listen to our cries. They need to care about how we feel and the fact that as students we live in an unconducive area, they don't care about that. All they care about is their pockets and chasing us out without having an alternative of where we are going to go. We are living in a nonsense of a place where the roof, are fo- the roof is falling off, there's no hot water, we don't have Wi-Fi for a main residence, that puzzles me. And, uh, I don't know what I'm going to say, but I don't know what I'm going to say, but I don't know what I'm going to say, but I don't know what I'm going to say, but I don't know I'm not funded, me. I'm not funded, so I'm going to say, but I'm going to keep saying, Stealing soya, man. Stealing soya. So there is no way in a party in Shalala and Sugum Zami plane, the good thing in Tolin, the wings of was in Shalala two or three days. So that's the good thing in Tolin Mile and Hampton Wayne car.